Two days after tragedy, grief is outpacing hope. It just didn't hit me until I got here. I saw all this crap and I'm just like, damn, you know? It just doesn't make any sense, man, it doesn't. And it hurts like crazy right now. With each victim identified, a friend is lost. Osby lost eight. And I love them so much. I love them so much, man. Everybody that I know in the city is affected by this. Rachel Saxer is still waiting to hear about three of her friends. When she considers friends of friends, she says the number is staggering. We lost like a, a lot of beautiful people. People who say they felt they could be themselves in a safe space, though the physical place they gathered may not have been. Yeah, we parted in the unsafest warehouses ever. Brings up a lot of questions. Brings up a lot of questions for our city and how we treat space and how we treat people. Questions that will come later. The focus now on finding those who are still missing. It's sad when we lose one life in Oakland, and it's even more sad when we lose dozens. It just sucks. I mean, I've known most of those people, like, you know, half my lifetime, you know. In Oakland, Melanie Woodrow, ABC 7 News.